Here we are using the Easy Hole template kit from MrFinstools.com. I just marked on the post all five hole locations, just marking the top of each hole. These will line up with the holes on the post behind me, creating a horizontal semi-privacy fence. We're gonna route this into the existing corner post using a battery-powered router, a clamp to hold the template in place, and a clockwise motion. You can plunge cut the route, drop the router into the post, and then follow the template. This special router bit I'm using has a 3 16 offset collar that keeps the cutting edge of the router bit away from the template. This is gonna prevent damage to the template for future use. This also means that the mark on the post that I want the top of my hole to be needs to be 3 16 of an inch away from the template kit. So the template kit should be 3 16 of an inch above your mark. This is pretty quick to do. I was able to route all five of these holes in about three minutes. And continue doing this one project when needed. This is a lot easier and more accurate than using a jigsaw or an oscillating tool or a sucker saw, um, a roto zip. Um, so this speeds up the process and leaves you with a clean factory, professionally cut hole. I would advise you just to practice a few before you go out and do this in the field, as the router itself sometimes wants to jump when you drop it in, plunge cut it. Another way to prevent that is to pre drill a hole, then drop the router bit in, and go in a clockwise motion. You'll notice here on one hole, I have the clamp slightly in the way. So be careful of the clamp at the very bottom of the mainframe, and you won't have to adjust it like I just did there. I can move the clamp out of the way of the router itself. Definitely a great tool to have in your truck. You never know when you got a field route. In this case, we had a bunch of field routing to do, and this made quick work of it. So you can find us at MrFenceTools.com, and we can get you inserts to fit just about any profile you're using.